We have students who have ocular visual impairments, your traditional blindness or low vision. And then we also have students who have complex needs, complex bodies. A lot of them, I mean, we use in Help Kids Learn and inclusive technology products with all of them as for our children who have neurological visual impairment, we do use these products a lot because of the high contrast to the movement and the backlighting. A lot of them are working on like switch skills or eye gaze in order to help with access. These products really help us kind of determine access and help us practice and so that we can get a better feel of what's going to be the most successful. I'm always looking at our like picture books, like what is visually accessible to them? What can we simplify or make high contrast? Um, what real objects can we bring to a literacy um, process? And so a lot of times, with our literacy topics, I might find something within Help Kids Learn to also share with them. So let's say we're doing a unit on um, March Madness or basketball. Then I might, oh, for speech, we're gonna practice playing basketball with our switches. So we might play with the basketball on recess, we might talk about basketball, those sorts of things. And then I might bring in something from Help Kids Learn for them to do digitally is adapted play. I think Choose It Maker, allowing you to create your own activities, you can start with that airless learning piece. So if kids yeah. are just learning to access switches for the first time, I can make a Choose It Maker that meets them where they're at. And then we can grade that as they grow and develop skills to make it more challenging for them. I think and they're proud that they can actually do a, a simple comprehension mm -hmm. quiz. You know, like, yes, I can talk about something other than just, you know, my sensory toys or. I've seen one teacher this year start using it to help kids with spelling their name. Oh, um, so you. find the D and then find the E and so on and so forth through through the- um, The Choose a Maker. Yep, through Choose a Maker, yep. Our young children, they love Big Bang patterns, pictures. Uh, they love the counting songs that just that simple continuation yeah. cause effect on iPad and um, the computer. Yeah. I was gonna say, I've seen like families come in and see their child um, use the switches. And they're like surprised. They're like, oh my gosh, like he can do that. Like I had no idea. Like and it kind of shows also like what their child might, you know, know. I have a student that's working on the eye gaze. Um, when she can target a shape and it makes a funny noise, she just, like, just cracks up. <laughs> and, and it's it's just hilarious. And she's so motivated to use that. This creates so much independence and adapted play. 